Hi, my name is Johnny Stewart. I'm the Clinical Research Fellow on the Northern Ireland COVID Vaccine Trial. So most of the vaccines which are being developed worldwide work by targeting the spike protein which sits around the edge of the coronavirus. The vaccine we're working on in Northern Ireland is the Novavax vaccine. This vaccine works by essentially creating an artificial version of the coronavirus spike protein. And when that's injected into your body, your body recognizes that as abnormal or foreign and produces an immune response against it. And the other thing that's interesting about the Novavax vaccine is that it has what's called an adjuvant, which is essentially a booster which heightens your immune response against coronavirus. So when your body sees coronavirus again, it's ready to fight against it. I'm Professor Judy Bradley, the director of the Northern Ireland Clinical Research Facility. So the vaccine, um, the Northern Ireland Vaccine Delivery Group brought together all parts of the Northern Ireland research infrastructure, including staff from the Clinical Research Facility, the Northern Ireland Clinical Research Network, the Cancer Trials Network, and the Clinical Trials Unit, with staff from Queen's University Belfast, and students from Queen's University Belfast and Ulster University working together to deliver the Novavax clinical trial to 500 participants in Northern Ireland. So the Novavax trial is a UK-wide trial which has recruited 15,000 participants from across the UK. The interesting about this trial is it's focused on over 65 group and 25% of the trial is over the age of 65. In Northern Ireland, in October and November, we recruited 500 participants to the trial, and we'll now follow them up for a period of a year. The trial's main aims are, number one, we've seen from the earlier phases of the trial that the vaccine appears to be safe, and it seems, seems to produce a good immune response. And what we want to see is, does that continue to be the case for the full period of a year? And number two, we want to see if, if we give half the participants in the trial the active vaccine, does that protect them against COVID-19 and most importantly protect them against severe cases of COVID-19? We thought it'd be interesting to give you an idea of what it's like to be a participant in the COVID vaccine trial. So we want to take you through the patient experience as they come through the trial. So involvement in the trial starts by signing up to the NHS vaccine registry. So in the middle of 2020 they released the NHS COVID-19 vaccine registry where you could sign up to become involved in the vaccine trials. When the Novavax trial recruitment period started, we contacted participants directly, inviting the participants on the vaccine registry to be involved in the trial. The next process is coming to the Northern Ireland Clinical Research Facility. When you arrive at the building, you're escorted up to the clinical research facility floor to ensure that the participants are safe. The first step is informed consent and that's absolutely vital so participants know exactly what's involved in the trial and the risks and benefits of being involved. The next step is a screening assessment and that involves finding out a bit about your medical history and some other details about you to find out do you actually meet the criteria for the trial. The next step is we take some bloods to find out do you have antibodies which suggest that you might have had COVID-19 in the past and we also do a swab to find out have you got COVID-19 today when you, when you arrive at the building. The next step is vaccination, and then you come back three weeks later for your second vaccine dose. So the other part of the trial that's really important goes on behind the scenes is the data in the trial and a huge amount of work goes on behind the scenes to make sure that the data in the trial is clean and complete. 
And the next step is follow up. And there's two halves to follow up. So one half is where you come here to the Northern Ireland Clinical Research Facility to, fi to find out is the vaccine continue to be safe? Have you had any problems with the vaccine? And the other really important half of the trial is to, find, is to follow up to find out, do you go on to get COVID-19? And in particular, severe cases of COVID-19. And for that, we've got an essential collaboration with the Belfast COVID Centre, where participants go for assessment to find out, number one, have they got COVID-19? And number two, how severe is it? This has been a truly collaborative project, bringing together staff from across academia and health and social care in Northern Ireland. The multidisciplinary team of academics and healthcare professionals have been working round the clock to deliver the trial. We're extremely grateful for the participants, to the participants from across Northern Ireland who've come out to support the trial. I'm particularly proud of the role that primary care has played in the trial. Despite the current pressures in general practice, 25 local GPs have come forward to be the trial doctors and the Belfast COVID Centre has played an absolutely vital role. We hope that the infrastructure and expertise that have been developed through the trial will lead to future exciting research projects in Northern Ireland.